Hey again guys, do you know what I like to do when I'm hanging out with Babe Ruth? I like to look at some baseball cards. Hey man, I'm excited. I got an unexpected care package, a big box from a Facebook friend of mine, Kevin Blackhurst, KB Sports Cards. I bought a lot of cards from him over the years. Uh, met him early on on Facebook in, in groups and uh, he runs uh, he runs a, an auction site or a selling site uh, on their page and uh, always always gives me great stuff he sent me a few care packages over the years in addition to the cards I bought from him uh, but one of the good guys in the hobby I know he sets up at card shows at least in Pittsburgh so uh, before I before I get into that uh, I have to show you uh, how my latest Sports Collectors Digest came. Just the front page in this envelope by the post office. I mean, why bother? The government just wasted an envelope. Oh, but hey, if I got into all the money the government wastes, take up the whole video. Kevin, thank you so much. Man, I appreciate this. Let me show you guys what I got. First, got this surf <laughs> detergent uh, book with all the tops pirate cards ever made by year, which is awesome. Never saw one of these. I think I have all these cards with maybe the exception of uh, like the 52, 53, 55s, maybe some of the 54s. I probably need a few. Uh, but now it's easy to checklist them. That thing's awesome. And he sent me this old calendar. 100 years of baseball. From, uh, it's a 1987 calendar. And this was from Sports Collectors Digest. And it has cards here on every page. Now, Kevin, I am angry with you f for one thing. And that is, you know how obsessive I am. And I had to go out and spend $77 to buy frames for all these. <laughs> all right. First, we have these. Uh, he sent me a bunch of uh, uncut panels, uh, full sheets. So I have the Purina cards from 1987. And many of these are like uh, you punch out. 1987 Purina card, uncut sheet. And we have the uh, Chef Boyardee. Man, I miss the 80s and 90s. They put cards, everybody issued cards. Chef Boyardee, uncut sheet. These are fabulous. And this is Jiffy Pop. Who remembers these these discs? And these uh, these are punch outs. Uncut sheet of those. And these Jiffy Pops here from 87. And man, this is awesome. Uh, I guess it was in the, the Pittsburgh Press, I believe. Uh, but they did these uh, during the Steeler Super Bowl years, uh, they did these features uh, where they would have a, a whole sheet uh, for every player. And he sent me the whole list of them. And I can't, man, I'm disappointed. I'm, I'm trying to find a big book to put these in, a big art book. But for now, I have them in here. And I just, I put half of them here and half on the other side. But there's the Lynn Swan. 
Man, I'll bet you there aren't too many of these still around. These are awesome. Here's the LC Greenwood with sunglasses. I would love to find a, an art book so I could display them all. And I had to switch frames because uh, one didn't fit. <laughs> So I, uh, I switched them up and I put uh, my uncut sheet of uh, top supers in here. They look great in these. And this, and that's Steelers. That might be my favorite piece, but I love this too. Now this, this was, uh, this is hanging on by a thread um, on both of these uh, when I opened it up. Um, so they're stuck in the middle still so this is still stuck and uh, these are pittsburgh pirate cards from 1989 and a whole uncut sheet of them and you got the great players here this is right before they won uh the three national league championships and uh, man, they were a game away from going to three World Series. Um, so you have Bonilla, Barry Bonds, and all those guys. Uh, fantastic piece. Kevin, I cannot thank you enough. That was so unexpected. I get this big box. I, I don't know who it's from. Uh, just amazing. Man, I don't know about you. Uh, I hear a lot of people complaining about uh, all the different YouTube influencers and a lot of the crap that goes on in the hobby but the people I associate with are fabulous people and you just need to stay in your lane you know there's a lot of horrible people in in the world you don't have to be friends with them all Kevin thank you so much and thank you for watching thanks so much guys